Derby manager Arthur Cox missed another match because of his bad back. Today, some would say he had a bad side too. Paul Devlin certainly found it easy to carve himself an opening. And this was just the start. Gary McSwigan put knots in front after nine minutes. Only five minutes later, Phil Turner scored not second. And the Magpies, at this stage, were making the millionaires look miserable. You began to wonder which of these teams cost £11 million to put together. McSwigan was there again to dive in for his second. He'd also hit the post and Turner the bar as Knox played some brilliant football. Derby didn't really deserve anything from the first half, but a dubious penalty right on half-time gave them some hope. Dykstra, a judge to have brought down Gabbiadini. Steve Cherry, though, denied them even that consolation. And after Mark Pembridge's miss, Derby needed an early goal in the second half if they were to start climbing the comeback mountain. It came from Marco Gabbiadini. But Knotts, looking for their fifth home win on the trot, had Gary McSwigan to crush their spirits again. His hat-trick, a fine individual effort. Not bad for £400,000. Derby haven't won away all season, and as for Arthur Cox's back pains, they're about to get worse as the knives go in.